Welcome to another installment of Property Vlogs. Today I'm here to show you the Stratford, which is a fantastic new build house and a show home that we want to show you by Red Row Homes. We're in the fantastic location in this countryside setting in Rugby right now on this amazing day. And things like the pricing, the size, and also the specification is going to be, all the information is going to be in the description via link. So click the link to find out more and stay with us to see the visual tour. Hello, come inside on this amazing day. Welcome to my brand new house. So number one is I want to touch on the property vlogs, absolute top 10 things we like to see in new build houses is this integrated matting. I love the fact that it's been already thought, thought of. So bring in your muddy shoes, kick them off here, and then you can go into the rest of the house. So first impressions of the front door, it's taller than your average front door. And that is a red row feature I've noticed is the ceilings are quite elevated. So it makes the space feel not as enclosed. And I love that. You've got a viewing panel there, bringing in lots of light. It's great for kind of monitoring the silhouette, but there's also a security keyhole there. Great feature. So now that we're in the hallway, the first room that you're going to notice is this one here, which is the downstairs toilet. So the downstairs toilet, we've got spotlights here. Again, just bear in mind what's an upgrade and what's a standard feature. You've got a spotlight here. It's a two piece suite, one piece, two piece. So you've got your toilet and your sink. They're both by Sotini and the taps also by Sotini. So that's going to be probably the the brand that's behind all the sanitary wear. In the floor, we've got actually what looks like to be luxury vinyl tiling done in a wood effect. I love that. Very durable and hard wearing. Now you've got a window bringing lots of light and ventilation. Okay, so that's the downstairs toilet. Good location of it as well. And then as you walk out of that, you've got your staircase. It's a winding staircase which goes all the way to the top. And then you've got a window actually in the hallway as well, which is great for light again connecting with the outdoors now we didn't have a cloak by the front door but here we do have a storage uh, nook underneath the stairs i love that utilize as much space as possible i can never be mad at a developer that says here's some bonus storage space that's great maybe consider adding a light to that so that it's more versatile and functional for maybe the darker months where you don't have lots of light but again i'm sure you're all waiting for this both well the actual main main part of the house which is the open plan dining kitchen area it's currently staged as a dining kitchen but just remember furniture is movable so this could be a snug living area tv on the wall and then a kitchen or whatever you want it to be but again you've got a six seater table here add two chairs at the end it's an eight seater and it expands and it's just a great place for having you know your friends round cooking and this would be an amazing point for us to welcome to this channel our sponsor of this video which is hello fresh hello fresh is a revolutionary food delivery service every week you can choose to receive a box full of delicious dinner ideas with the exact fresh ingredients you need to cook them i love this because it means there's zero wasting of food but not only that all of the ingredients are delivered directly to your door so that's bye bye to supermarket shopping. I especially see this being great for someone who travels frequently or works late and hates coming back home to a fridge full of items that have gone out of date. If you do want to try HelloFresh, make sure you use our affiliate link in the description. Our discount code PROPERTYVLOGS50 will get you 50% off your first box and then you get a 35% off the next three and then three free gifts on top of that. And yes, thank you so much to HelloFresh for sponsoring this video. Thank you for watching that as well. And let's carry on with the rest of the tour. So this is the dining area. You've got this almost wall to wall large um, UPVC windows that open towards the garden. Very generous, I have to say, that this is all kind of like a picture window and it really opens the back to the rest of the house. I don't really see many properties that have this really this large expanse of glass. And yes, guys, unfortunately, we don't actually have garden access. So I will talk you through the garden really quickly. You're gonna have paving and lawn as standard. This is a show home, so they've 
upgraded the landscaping. We've added all these stunning shrubs and plants, lighting features, kind of put maybe even water features. But what you would actually get in your house is lawn and paving to access around the garden. And then you have to imagine where your house starts and stops. There's going to be a fence between the neighbors because we can't actually open them up like this. So that's the garden. And then the kitchen has this amazing island. Great size kitchen, I have to say, because the space between the island and the rest of the kitchen is just, it's just lovely. Sometimes an islands are kind of wedged in, not in this case, there's so much circulation around. So you can imagine having like the family round sat up against the island. I just like it. Um, it's a great position as well. The storage in the island, and then obviously you've got little gadgety things like this, which is your, Kind of your sockets and a USB fitting there. That may be an upgrade, guys, but it's good to know that it's an option you can have. On this side, you've got your breakfast bar as well. So it's really good for like, you know, they've put a laptop there, a dummy laptop there. You can imagine kids getting ready for school. You bring everyone together. They can charge their devices in there, eating breakfast, and then you're off to, you know, continue the rest of your day. So we've got fridge, freezer. And I love the design of the actual kitchen. Again, this is a very kind of on-trend thing, having the two-tone cabinets as well. And then they've also contrasted that. So the color palette is very nice and neutral with an emphasis on a wood grain. We've got integrated AEG appliances in a double configuration there. All the specification is in the link in the description. So we've got storage as well. And these are kind of taller than your usual wall-mounted cabinets. So they're really giving you a lot of storage. You've got storage there. You've got recessed lighting there as well. And then this, what we're looking at right now is a laminate worktop in a wood grain. And laminate, don't turn your nose up at laminate because laminate, when it's tastefully done and well done, is very durable and it can still look very modern and classy. We've got our AEG extract fan and hob as well. Large hob, I love this. This is for someone who loves to cook. And then we've got stainless steel splashback. And then I like the fact that we now free up all the space to be a generous um, cutlery drawer. So again, I like to show you the storage because, you know, people want to realistically know um, Will all my stuff fit in this house? And I can confidently say that there is so much storage in this kitchen. Again, cabinets. <laughs> cabinets, you can see what's, oops, sorry guys. They are on soft closers, by the way. Siemens, dishwasher, cabinets. And this bonus cabinets, it's like a mini pantry. You don't really see many kitchens in new build houses that have this additional storage. Again, we've got our stainless steel sink, one and a half ball by Blanco, a very practical chrome tap, bank of sockets there for your appliances to switch them off, and then a shelf, decorative shelf, USB uh, sockets there as well. Oh, mystery door number one. Isn't that just amazing? So you're probably wondering, there's, is there a utility where the appliances, this is where they are, and it's you can close that off. So acoustically, that's fantastic. Um, Siemens appliances in a stackable arrangement. This is what we're seeing, guys. So it's good to know the Red Rose look forward thinking. So we're seeing more developers think about, not developers, house builders think about, you know, the future of these properties. Stackable units is just the way forwards. It's better than having everything down low that you have to bend and grab. There will be some units higher up, which is great for those days where you have a lot of laundry. Now let's keep moving and go to the next, joking. So before you go, you're probably wondering, what else is there on this floor? There is a family room. So this family room, again, quick assessment, rectangular in plan, and it's a good arrangement. From your viewpoint, that's your focal point, 
but you could spin it around. Some people like an open arrangement where the sofa faces the door. And so when people come in, you can kind of greet them, smile at them. You can interact with whoever's moving throughout the house. So the sofa could have gone on here and the TV could have gone over there. And then this is just amazing. I love the splayed bay window. It's a very large window as well. Thing about Red Row that I love, again, is those integrated mats on the in the entrance large windows large windows great aspects of views outside of your garden and just tall ceilings and lots of light which is just priceless so yes this is the room it's got ample layout options and it's a really really nice size so let's keep moving let's keep going to the next space so let's go to the first floor we're going to walk past the window that I said I loved and connect with the rest of the development. Now, let me show you the first room on this floor. This is the single bedroom. Oh, this is so beautifully staged. I always like to give a shout out to whoever stages these rooms. This is a single bedroom done in a very kind of little girl's room style. Um, so yes, single bed faces is pushed against the wall. There's still enough space for a bedside table. She's got a fantastic outlook facing the front of the property. You can see the landscaping and obviously the rest of the, the development. You've got windows as well. Looks like only one of them is actually, there's two openable ones, which is great. And then there's space for a dresser in that corner or a full wardrobe, depending on what you wanna do. So yes, it ticks all the boxes single bed, bedside table and wardrobe and still space. Great. So let's keep moving. The next room is this one. So this is actually, I should have said it's a mystery door. It is your hot water cylinder and additional storage space. That's great. And just let you know, architrave wise and doors. I like to talk about these details. We've got your chrome handles there, architraves, architraves. <laughs> the doors are done in like a white kind of matte finish with two panels. So two panel doors with your standard architraves. So that's where they've kind of tailored it down a little bit to allow them to go up in the other areas. The next room I'm going to show you here is your family bathroom. Family bathroom, first thing head on is a window. Great. Lots of light and ventilation. And then there's a three piece suite. So there's a sink, a floating sink, toilet, and then a bathtub in the corner. They're fully tiled to the top with a shower over the bath. So that's very versatile. It's the way to kind of maximize your space nowadays, guys. Next room in front of me is another single bedroom. But you can see this room is one where it kind of, it can allow whoever is in here to kind of grow into it. So it's a single, but not a small one by any means. The bed's pushed against the wall there in the corner. You've got a bedside table next to it. Then we've got a homework area, which can easily be swapped out for like a full wardrobe, double wardrobe there. You've got a large window facing the back garden. You can just see how gorgeous the garden is. You can see the rest of the development, some options there for solar panels as well, which is very good for energy efficiency. And then you can see just how much space there is in this room. And then there is still more space. So this is another bedroom. This has a king size bed in it with two bedside tables either side. So I just love that. And can we just admire the space at the foot of the bed? There's still sufficient space at the foot of the bed. And then where the mirror is would be where you could have a TV. If you're a TV watcher, you've got a radiator and window facing the back garden. And then you've got fitted wardrobes over here as well with sliding doors. I love that. So that's that there. And yes, this is the a fantastic uh, additional bedroom. And let's keep it moving. And just in case you thought that was it, no, let us take you to the feature of the home, the primary bedroom. Again, staging is fantastic. I absolutely love this bedroom. It's been done in a green theme. You've got a king size bed again. And I want to just applaud every house builder that shows a king size bed in their bedrooms rather than doing all these kind of like visual trickery 
<laughs> illusions by putting small scale doll furniture. This is a king size bed with a large headboard. You've still got space for bedside tables either side. You've got a splayed bay window over here, bringing in lots of light, similar style to what we saw on the ground floor. And then it just lets you look at the side of the property a little bit, a little bit either side. And you know, with while still maintaining your privacy, and there's a little bit of a nook here for more storage. Yeah, why don't we scoot around a little bit? So there's space there for storage. And then you can see this door obviously takes you to the ensuite. You can see how much space you've actually got in this room. So let me show you the ensuite really quickly. Come with me. And it's through this door. So if you scoot over there and come around. So this is the ensuite. This is your bonus ensuite to your primary bedroom. Another window, that's great, bringing in lots of light. Toilet, tower rail, and then you've got a sink with a floating vanity underneath it. And then uh, this is going to be some showroom staging. I don't believe the medicine cabinet would come with the house, but it just shows you there's enough space for additional furniture or pieces that you might want to put in. So that's that. And then there's a large shower there with a you know shower handheld device and it's fully tiled all the way to the top the flooring is again that luxury vinyl tiling and it's all been paired in a kind of uh, in the same color palette to make it look absolutely fantastic so thank you so much for following us and touring this house with us if you saw anything that we missed please leave it in the comments and if you want to see more red row thought tour <laughs> if you want to see more red row tours we actually have a playlist that's going to pop up any minute now or you can click any of these videos and most of all subscribe so we can see you in the next video bye